Thank you, Danielle. And we really have to thank you, Western New York. Even during a pandemic, the City of Good Neighbors is giving back to those in need. It is incredible, isn't it? Your donations are filling up the trucks today, which just speaks to all of your generosity. And don't forget, you can text the number on your screen to donate right now. And we are joined now by John Persons, the president and the COO of Topps Markets, a longstanding Food to Families partner. And an interesting note about John, John began his career pushing grocery carts, we, I remember. Yeah, we love that. John, <laughs> thanks for joining us. And we want to start off by asking you about what you have seen so far today at your store. Yeah, thanks uh, for having uh, thanks for having uh, me, Mary Alice. Yeah, it's been a it's actually been a great day. It's uh, a little wet, a little gloomy at times, but that hasn't dampened the spirits of the people here or the people of uh, Western New York. Uh, and their generosity is really showing through. To put it in perspective, last year this event uh, provided about uh, 1.8 million meals uh, for for people for people in need. And this year we feel very comfortable that we're that we're going to hit two million meals. That is a lot of meals, John. Obviously, this year is a lot different, of course, than what we have done in years past. We've usually been there in person. Can you tell us a little bit about how this is, uh, how things are changing this year for this drive and for Tops? Yeah, you're absolutely right. Uh, Tops and Channel Two and Feedmore have been partnering for 17 years on this event, and this year is a little different. Uh, obviously because of the pandemic and we've uh, clearly safety is uh, very important and uh, so we've structured things a little different to make sure that people can give in a contactless way. Um, we're seeing a little bit less uh, uh, in-person giving today with people stopping by at our stores, but remarkably we're seeing more online gifts. Uh, we're seeing more generosity at our registers. We're selling uh, substantially more uh, little brown bags of hope uh, than we have last year. Uh, and again, all of those efforts uh, from the people of Western New York and our customers and of course uh, Channel 2 and every, every uh, supporter are going to go right to uh, Feed More Western New York to help people uh, in need in our community. That's really great to hear, John. And we want to let everybody know, too, that through our website, we have the link where you can make that virtual donation. But we also uh, want to ask you before we go specifically, what is TOPS doing to help the cause? We know this is something that means a lot to you and your TOPS employees. Yeah, Mary Alice, it absolutely does mean a, a great deal to all of us at TOPS. We know that uh, one in six people in our community uh, struggle with hunger issues on a, on a daily basis. Uh, and uh, on top of what we're doing today, on top of what we're doing through December 26 by selling little brown bags of hope, uh, we're going we're gonna to donate an additional $10,000 uh, of food product to uh, feed more Western New York. Much of that product is uh, right uh, behind me. That is an amazing generosity, John. We can't thank you enough. It's been great having you as a partner. John Persons, the CEO and president of Tops Markets. Thanks for being our partner and happy holidays. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate Tops and all of their assistance.